What's going on, y'all? It's a funky diabetic. Before I get started, allow me to apologize for not uploading a video in two weeks. My god. Had some technical difficulties, and to be honest, they're still not fixed. <laughs> but we're gonna have to power through it at this point. But us Celtics, we're really damn good. We are 7-0 and on the season. And I haven't played all these games. I played the game against the Bucks. I played the Grizzlies, I played the Jazz, and I played this Heat game here, and uh, I was going to upload this Heat game, it was a great game, it went into overtime, I was going to upload the four quarters as one video, and I was going to upload the overtime as another video, unfortunately due to technical difficulties, couldn't get it out, it sucks, it really does, but um, but yeah, we're 7-0, and we're doing really well in the season, and we've had some personnel changes, it turns out that Kirk Heinrich who was my backup point guard, was not happy with his role as a sixth man, so I had to trade him basically for a not as good point guard, so I traded him for CJ Watson. Now my reasoning for trading him for CJ Watson, I mean Heinrich, he, I had him as like a sixth man and I guess he wanted to be a starter, which, sorry, you're not going to be starting a point guard on this team, <laughs> it's just not going to happen. So I had to deal him for CJ Watson and Watson's pretty good, I mean, he's a good ball handler. He's a good three-point shooter, so I guess in terms of passing, I guess we lose a little bit, but I mean, Watson will do a good job as our backup point guard. So that's pretty much it. We have a game against the Orlando Magic, and you see uh, Watson, his minutes, he's got about 17 a game, so yeah. And now we've got the Orlando Magic. We got the Magic here in, uh, here in Boston. We're going for 8-0 on the season. And you'd figure after beating the Miami Heat, you'd think we would have no trouble with the Orlando Magic at all. We'll see what happens. Someone's open in the corner. It's Harkless. I'm on him with Bradley. He does have the size mismatch, though. Yeah. Bradley is a good defender, but sometimes that height mismatch, that can be the difference. Ten seconds, left ten seconds left in the half. Let's try to get a good shot. I'm going to drive with Watson. Oh, I got Bradley open. Three. Avery Bradley. Yeah. Oh, Humphreys the rebound and the foul. There you go, Chris Humphreys. See, guys, Humphreys is a good player, y'all. Don't let this guy open. I see a Flalo open. Oh, God, Nelson's open for three. Man, what is up with the defenders in this game leaving shooters wide open? I gotta call a timeout. I mean, come on, y'all. How are you gonna leave Jameer Nelson wide open for three? Oh, look at this. Nelson's disrespecting us in Boston? I can't have that. Hook shot with Olenek. Ah, man. That's a pretty good shot in my book. A hook shot with Kelly Olenek. That's a shot he can make. That's a shot I've hit with him many times. We're just not getting lucky right now. It seems like there's a lid on the basket. Play defense here. We've got Oladipo in the corner. Back to Nelson. Nelson's trying to drive on me. He gets to Vucevic. Yeah. Eight points. Throw something up with Humphreys. Mm. Well, we're down eight points going into the fourth quarter. We've had to come back a few times this season, and um, if we're going to win this game, we have to do it again. Do a pick and roll with Sollinger. Come on, so You got to actually set the pick. <laughs> oh, they both committed to Rondo. Open dunk for Sollinger. Let's go. Four-point game. Ooh, let's see the sexy replay. Look at the way the jersey moves, the legs. Oh, it's beautiful. Get this down to Sollinger. I'm going to have to spin baseline on Davis. Baseline. Shot over him. Foul. I have a chance to make this a one-point game if I make both of these free throws. I got the first. Sollinger's free throw is weird because it has like that pause right at the top. We got them both. One-point game. Play defense on this guy. He spins. Oh, he lost it. He tried to spin and he spun right into Jeff Green. I got to get this to Rondo. Rondo, where are you? There you are. I've got Sollinger in the post. He's got Aaron Aflalo on him. I got to go on this one. Oh, I got the space. The shot. Off the backboard. It's in. One point lead. With a minute and a half left. Play defense in the pick. Who is that? Oh, it's Glenn Davis. Thank God. Stay in front of this guy. He's going to have to shoot it. 
I jump with green. That's an air ball. We're up one. 40 seconds left. We have the chance to put it away here. I'm going to run my favorite play, a Jeff Green pick and roll. Oh, wait. Nelson's playing up on me. Let's try to drive by him first. Nah, I couldn't get it. All right, green, pick and roll, let's go. This play usually works. Oh, wow, they put in good defense on that one. Solinger, it's going to have to be you. I'm going to try that spin baseline again. Spin baseline over Davis. Yes! Three-point lead with about 20 seconds left. No threes. No threes. Passes to him. Why are they, why are they in the... Okay, whatever. Down to Davis. Shot. I jump with Solinger. Yes. I don't know why they didn't take a three-pointer there, but whatever. I got Marcus Camby at the free throw line. I just have to make one of these. Just make one and we got this. Although Camby is tired. Ah, crap. Damn it. Come on. Let's make one of these. Come on, Camby. Oh, no. They got the board. Watch that go in. Whew. If you've played 2K long enough, you know that might go in. <laughs> and we take the lead over the... We take the win, I should say, over the Orlando Magic. Close game. You, I mean, you'd think after beating the Heat, we could beat anybody, but that was a close game. Magic gave us a good one. We had to come back. Look at Rondo here, y'all. Rondo, he's got the little red letters. He's injured. He's got a... Um, I believe it's a separated shoulder. Yes, and uh, the GM asked me if I wanted to, uh, well, the owner, I should say, asked me if I wanted to change the rotation, and I basically just kept it the same. Rondo's still pretty good. He's like a 70-something overall. Yeah, and we got, look at the power rankings. We are number one in the NBA. We're above the Thunder. We're above everybody. We are considered to be the best team in the NBA right now at 8-0, and we're doing really well. That's the video, y'all. See ya.